Around 350 years ago, in 1666, the Danish geologist and anatomist Niels Stensen made a fascinating and equally as terrifying realization as he examined the carcass of a great white shark. Glossopedre, so called tongue stones, up to 18 cm or 7 inches big, broadly triangular fossils, which at the time were believed to be petrified tongues of giant snakes and dragons, were actually giant shark teeth. Teeth so big, they easily dwarfed the teeth of the great white shark he had examined. Virtually everyone who has since then grazed upon one of these teeth must have found it impossible to resist imagining the sheer enormity of the fish it belonged to. Because megalodon teeth are very similar in overall form to those of the living great white shark, just three times as big, megalodon first appeared around 16 million years ago. With a maximum total length of 18 meters or 60 feet and an approximate mass of up to 60 metric tons, it is the biggest shark that has ever lived. To put this into perspective, this makes it about as long as one and a half American school buses and about as heavy as 10 African elephants. Its large size may have been the result of the evolutionary arms race with water-living mammals, predecessors of today's whales, which reinvaded the sea around 50 million years ago. For the sharks of that time, sharks like Otodus, an ancestor of Megalodon, this meant a sudden abundance of food for everyone that was big enough to eat it. Fossil records show that these sharks fed on ancient whales more or less from the earliest beginnings, and as the whales grew bigger and more diverse, so did the sharks. This evolutionary event did initiate the Cacaroclus lineage, which would ultimately lead to Cacaroclus megalodon, some 40 million years later. By that time, this genus of sharks had doubled in length, multiplied in weight, and their teeth had evolved from a form that was more suited for eating bite-sized prey to a form that could reduce even the largest animals to manageable pieces. A form that we still find in great white sharks today 